Hi there, my name is Jasper and I will be your host this week for our new product introduction video. This week we will start off strong with the big 2023 release of Boker Plus and Magnum. On the table is a small sample of all that is to come from this German knife brand, of which we will highlight a couple. First off is the Boker Plus Urban Barlow, an elegant EDC knife with a design inspired by the classical Barlow styled knife. Its handle is made with titanium with either carbon fiber or coca bolo in lace. The blade is made out of bowler M390 steel. The front flipper ensures a very easy one-handed deployment with the pocket clip you carry in your pocket very securely so you won't lose it. Next up is another stylish EDC knife, this time a limited edition Quiken Mini. This is a Boker model that most of you will be familiar with, a more compact version of the original without losing any of its kick. The combination of the flipper and the ball bearings make the opening incredibly smooth. There's a titanium lock side with a titanium backspacer and a very colorful fat carbon show side scale. The dark gray of the titanium really makes the green of the handle pop. Next on the chopping block is the P51 Mustang Damascus. This is the newest chapter in the historical Damascus line made by Boker and steel maestro Chad Nichols once again did a fantastic job on the blade of this knife that includes metal from the original North American P51 Mustang plane. This knife is designed by Steve Kelly and this knife perfectly reflects the material, shape and color of the original fighter plane. A very cool detail is the American Shield pivot and it's one of the most eye-catching features of a P51 Mustang. Last but not least is this little guy. A small neck knife that goes by the name the Shrimp. Looking at its unique design, you see where the name comes from. It's very compact in size, but it feels very good in the hand and you have a lot of grip due to the nice full handle. It comes with this great Kydex sheath with a piece of power cord attached, which is length adjustable, so you can wear it around your neck. If you want to see these products and many more, definitely take a look at our Boker brand page on our website. And now for something completely different, this is the Lion Steel Aggie. It's available in three different colors, gray, bronze, and blue. You use the Aggie for many different things because it is in fact a small multi-tool or a bit kit, depending how you look at it. It comes with several different attachments like these four sizes of Torx, a flathead screwdriver, a glass breaker, and even a small knife which you can use to open the parcel when you're in a pinch. But what makes the Aggie different from other bit kits and multi-tools? Well, Lion Steel is a leading manufacturer when it comes to titanium gear and this Aggie is a great example because it's really hard to manufacture. If you look at all the details in the Aggie, with the holes in the inside where you can hold all the bits, you won't find anything like this. So if you're in need of a premium multi-tool or bit kit, that you can easily clip on your keychain to adjust your pivot of your pocket knife on the go, or you simply want something different for a change, then the Aggie is an excellent choice. By the way, if you want to keep up to date with these weekly new product videos, tutorials, and many other informative videos, be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel. And now, Time for steak. Over here, we have the next product for you. This is perhaps not a product you will carry around with you, but definitely still a very nice and beautiful knife. These swilling four-piece steak knives are not only sleek and stylish, but they're also great for cutting your favorite pieces of meat. The design is reminiscent of the Albacid steak knives of 1734. And they come in three different handle materials, a light home oak, a dark rosewood, and a blue micarta handle. These knives have no serrations, so they'll actually cut the meat instead of ripping it to shreds, keeping all the juices and the nice flavor in the piece of meat. It also makes them a lot easier to sharpen. The handle is nice and thin, making the knife very lightweight, and the slight downward swoop of the handle makes the knife very nice to hold. Let's stay in the kitchen and continue on with the food prep. With this Kaishun Tim Maltzer, Kamagata series. For some of you, this series will be nothing new because the Tim Maltzer Kamagata series is a very popular combination of the Japanese Kai brand and the well-known German TV chef Tim Maltzer. New, however, in the series are the office knife and the utility knife with the pointed tip. This makes precise work even easier when you're cutting. Traditionally, a Kamagata knife has a completely straight edge and a round back. However, Tim Maltzer has given this series its own touch. Thus, the knives have a sharply tapered tip and a slight curve in the blade. Design meets functionality. The Kai Tim Maltzer Kamagata series is great if you want your kitchen knives to have Japanese design, but a bit more of the European ease of use. Then, on to Sweden. The new Ashwood series by Moraknif includes four different knives, 
a one grit Jeff Finn, which is an all round hiking knife with a full tang blade with an 8.7 centimeters long blade. And then we have the Wit, which is also a full tang knife with a 10.3 centimeters long blade. We have the Lock, which is also full tang and also has a pretty nice blade of 10.9 centimeters. And then we have this outdoor cooking knife, the Rombo, which has an 11.9 centimeters blade. The blades are made out of recycled stainless steel. The handles are made of European ash wood and they come with these incredibly well-made leather sheaths. So whatever the task, there's a Moraknif Ashwood knife there that perfectly embodies it. These are the most premium Moraknif knives out there, made entirely with sustainability in mind. From the recycled stainless steel blades to the recycled cardboard packaging. This was a little snippet of the products of this week that we were most hyped about. What are some of you guys most anticipated upcoming new products? Let us know in the comments below. We put new products online every week, so be sure to check out our new products page at knivesandtools.com.